In this video, we're going to have a look at how to add a repeater to the home page showing the featured products using the advanced query. So here we have our products on the home page. And what I'm going to do now is just head over to the product section and we'll head over to products and I'm going to set a new product as a featured product. So let's choose the cap. So I'm going to head over to the cap. We'll quick edit. I'm just going to make that a featured product and update and now when we refresh the page you'll see that the cap appears in the listing likewise i'm going to take the sunglasses and deselect them so sunglasses quick edit no longer featured well update head back to the page now the sunglasses will no longer be available so that's pretty much how we can pull in the, only the featured products onto the home page so to show you how that fits together, here we are in Oxygen and let's go and have a look at the query. So when we look at the query, you'll see that it's a taxonomy query. So first of all, we select the post type as product. Then we select the taxonomy query with the relation of and. We then create the array. So we say taxonomy is the product visibility. The field is the name. The terms, we use the term featured the operator in and then to remove pagination we say no found rows true and to the next parameter we'll add is maybe what we're going to do is just post per page per page and we're going to add that value and going to make that four so we'll save that and now when we head over to the front page, you'll see that now we only have the four items. And there we have our um, featured products. If we want to change the order, so let's go to the query here and let's add a parameter, perhaps order by. So we'll say order by and let's say title and then we'll add the next parameter and we'll change that order then to ascending so now we'll have ascending alphabetically right so now we have t-shirt cap hoodie and now when we refresh you'll see that album cap hoodie and if we had had to reverse that then the order will change so the parameters for order and order by then apply now to the featured products only and so we refresh that and now we see the names in the reverse order so if I was to remove hoodie with zipper as a featured product let's see hoodie with zipper so I'm going to remove them as a featured product the hoodie with zipper will no longer be visible so that's how you do it with the query so we we do the taxonomy query and in the array that we create we say taxonomy product visibility field is name terms featured and the operator in so I hope you found that uh, video useful thank you for watching